Hello, welcome back to my channel. It is Sunday morning, December 3rd, 2023, in case, you know, a year from now you're like, what is this? Oh, so anyways, so this is the third day of my advent calendar vlogging for 2023. And if you have been keeping up with this, um, this year I am doing the coffee advent calendar um, from Aldi, and I got myself a little chocolate one. So I still haven't got the tree up, but I did get the tree, and I did deliver my niece's um, um, advent calendars to her um, last night. She was super excited. She got um, a craft one, and then she got one of these. So hopefully she will be sharing her crafts with me over maybe send some pictures. Her mom will send some pictures to me um, so I can uh, see what Christmassy crafts Miss Ada, shout out to Miss Ada, will be doing. Today's her birthday party too. So happy birthday Adeline. Um, so here we go. Um, so today, but today I am going to be putting up a Christmas tree. I've got a bunch of work stuff I have to finish and um, more packing up stuff so um to 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 put away for the holiday season to make room for said tree so hopefully tomorrow I'm pretty sure tomorrow I, I will have a beautiful tree behind me um so let's get started on Advent and then we'll go into some fun stuff so uh today's coffee flavor we had a little mishap with our little Keurig cup um, so I looked at my coffee, there were lots of coffee grounds, luckily the, um, the, the, the one that I got from Aldi has the little basket for the coffee grounds, so I filtered the coffee through that to sift out all of the coffee grounds, but my little cup, as you can see, I don't know if you can see that, the little, say it fell apart in the old Keurig's, I've never had that happen with any of my, um, little K-cups that I get from Aldi. So, I don't know what happened there, but I hopefully this is not a trend, Mr. Aldi. Um, so, but today's flavor, you didn't already see, was sugar cookie coffee. Surprised they didn't save this for, like, Christmas Eve for Santa. Um, so, sugar cookie coffee. Here we go. In my Meowy Christmas mug from Target last year. Meowy Christmas. Um, so, yeah, here we go. This one's kind of nice. I like this one. I don't have any creamers or anything in it. This is just pleasant. It's got a pleasant taste. I don't really taste sugar. It's just a nice, pleasant taste, even without anything in it. Straight out the thing off, minus the filtering the coffee grounds out for because of the mishap. But uh, here we go. It's it's kind of pleasant. Oh, quick update on yesterday's. I added the creamer and stuff that I like to put in there. Still had a hint of bitterness, but was better with the creamer. All right, but this one without anything in it, very nice, very pleasant. All right, so let's move on. Let's move on to our chocolate calendar. Day three. Do, 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 do. I am a little sad I did miss out on the fancier Aldi ones, but it always seems like they have the same flavors every year anyway. So this is day three. I got a, I guess it's supposed to be a Christmas star or something. I have no idea. I'm going to assume that's a Christmas star. Um, so there you go. Um, this was a fun little buy. My nieces, my nephew, they get this one every year. My nephew last year gave his to him Thanksgiving. The next day, there was just an empty packet. He didn't do the advent count. He just ate it all in one sitting. Passed it on the floor with this laying next to him. All right. That was me as a child. I can't judge him because that was me as a child. So what else is going on? Well, since I'm doing my trip, today um I'm gonna show you some ornaments that have been picked up over the year by my sister at flea markets estate sales and some things I picked up at Target when they had some things on sale but first I'm probably gonna try to wear this tomorrow if I can get it through the washing machine um <laughs> Black Friday find um so T Republic had their shirts on sale um for Black Friday so um <laughs> if you know me I love Adam Ant and I saw in one of the Adam Ant groups on Facebook one wearing this particular design and I love um, the Prince Charming um, video and I love that song um, so I found this well they they had it on and I said where did you get this and they told me where to find it and on Black Friday they had their t-shirts on sale so it came in the mail last night I was so happy it is my Prince Charming Adam Ant shirt I love it I love this thing so the only thing I don't like about like this print on demand you're always like well I guess this will fit and then you get it, and you're like, maybe it's a little small. But this is a 
this is a me no this is a small okay maybe i should have went with a medium but we will see we will see I'll t i'm gonna try to wear this this sometime this week before i start into my christmas extravaganza outfits which i will be sh start showing off soon um so um the christmas ornaments yes the christmas ornaments all right so um I'll first i'll start off with my target find so last year they had lots of the little felt kitty cat because i have a kitty cat tree the felt kitty cat ornaments this year they didn't have much in the like the three dollar bin all they had was this which is kind of strange and they had the little white one but i got it because i gotta have some some things and i like little felted ones but um the previous years they were much cuter they had lots of cute doggy ones this is all i saw in the kitty cat section no ballerina kitty cats this year no kitty cats with little with little coats on or anything like that just these two in the three dollar bin now they did return these but they, they you know every year they add new things in their little hands let me see if i can get this so um so yeah i got this guy again the little calico with a with a present these were like i think 30 20 or 30 percent off i can't remember um it was right around um veterans day this one with his little his little um his little plant thing and then um the little black cat with his little star all right this one i have never seen this particular one and if you know me i love my little flame point so i thought oh, okay well this could this could represent a flame point and it's super cute because he's covered in lights all right or she what, whatever you want to make this okay super cute so i had to get that one so those were my target like brand new actually i did get another one since this was on sale i think they were 30 percent off i'm pretty sure they were i got a merkitten although this is from um cabbie's dollhouse and i got a um, cabbie's dollhouse last year at the end of christmas it was like a little cat cupcake thing i don't i don't watch this i don't know what this is i just liked it because it was cat and same thing with the one i got last year but yeah i got a little cat a cat mermaid i thought that was super cute so all of that was on the saleage um now for my oh there were a few other ones um someone picked these up for me at the hoblob the hoblob i'm not a fan of the hoblob but there you go um they're okay um you find some stuff but um so they had these little wooden cut out cats those will be cute on the cat tree there we go those i don't know if you saw that white and a little tuxedo cat they're cute a little tabby and a little orangey yellow cat so um so yeah those are fun those were also on the sale um, my sister picks up a lot of stuff for me. So, um, this I found, if you watched my, um, flea market, um, video back over the summer, um, I found this one at the flea market and I grabbed it because I'm always on the lookout. Um, as you can see, it's a kitty cat. I need to open it because I'm going to put this thing on my tree today. Anyways, so, um, this video is coming much longer than I had anticipated. Um, but yeah, <laughs> it's kitty cat mailing a letter to, uh, to... To a special friend. I, th I thought it was going to be Santa Paws, but no, it's to a special friend. Look at it. Isn't it cute? All right. So that's going on my tree. My sister found this at an estate sale. She's always, she's the estate sale flea market um, yard sale queen of my life. Um, she takes after my grandparents. We used to have a flea market booth, antique booth, um, before they passed away. She doesn't have a booth. That's, that's I'm, I'm encouraging her. She should do that. Um, here is a kitty cat by Wishing Well. She got that for me. She got this little guy all Christmased out. I thought he was cute. And then she got this little guy, this little stuffed ornament. I try not to get break too many breakables because, you know, the cats attack the tree anyway. Um, but um, And then she got this one, which I thought was so sweet. And a little flame point looking angel cat. Oh, look at the little flame point. I love my little flame point cats. Um, and then she also found this at an estate sale. My sister is too good to me. Um, she found these because when I was a child, I have like a vintage toy shelf of all like my childhood memories. I have mostly Jim, but I've got a couple of shelves of some other things that I loved as a child. She found these, the little mermaid. They're still in the box. I think she got this at a Goodwill. Um, but she got the Sebastian. I think there were only two. I think I saw a commercial come up on Facebook because, you know, they hear your conversations and they advertise to you. Um, but um, and I saw, like, a, someone had posted, I think it was, like, Dinosaur Dracula or somebody like that on Facebook. They post, like, old commercials and stuff. But there is the cute, cute, cute Sebastian. And there's his box. And then there was Flounder. I wonder why they didn't do Ariel. Probably because they don't know her. 
Um, but, and then there is a flounder with his holiday hat. Isn't that adorable? So those are some of the ornaments that she found. And then she found this at a flea market. It's a Lefton. It's called Kitty Snowflakes from 1992. This I'm going to have to put away because the cats will knock this off and break it. It's a little white Christmas cat. He is so cute. So those are some of the things my sister has found for me. My sister's too good to me with the flea market stuff. She always keeps me in mind looking for Jim and kitty cat ornaments. Um, so yeah, those are my, or those are the, the new additions. <laughs> Sister, you usually don't have this much to add to a tree every year, but she, she had a goal. She was like, here, she just handed me a bag. Um, it's over here, like a Target or a big Winn-Dixie bag full of ornaments. It was like, here, I found all these. Um, so that was pretty exciting. So what did we learn today? My sister's looking out for me at the estate sales, flea markets, and yard sales. Thank you. Thank you, ma'am. And she's also addicted to whatnot now. I don't know if anyone's on whatnot, but she loves whatnot. Um, so, I, and, and then we also learned that I am totally obsessed with Adam Ant right now, and I got myself a t-shirt on Black Friday. I am so excited. Look, it's Prince Charming. I love that song. Um, so, and let's see. Oh, yeah, and the whole reason we're here, Advent calendars. We had the chocolate. It was a star. It was yummy. It's the same flavor every day. There's no change. So you know, you know, you have something to count on every day. $1.49. And then we did our coffee advent calendar. Woohoo. And there's the inside. It was day three. Woo! Right there at the corner. And it was sugar cookie, but the cup malfunctioned, dumping, dumping, malfunctioned, dumping. I need to finish my coffee. Dumping the um, grounds into my coffee but luckily I filtered it out with my little coffee ground thing and then here it is sugar cookie one more taste see if I still feel the same about it very pleasant all right so there we are day three a lot going on get the tree up get these ornaments on them um, get some other stuff done also check out my try on video for my my sparkly butt pants joggers from the all die that i got on the clearance the other day so check that out um more videos to come i'll see you guys tomorrow for another advent vlog december 4th I, the, this month always flies by so before i know it i'm going oh i'm doing my advent calendar so stay tuned i'll see you tomorrow like subscribe all that nonsense bye